Hi everybody. Um, I thought I'd take the time to do this video um, of my craft space. This is a space that I have a room in my bedroom. So this is like the sitting area of my bedroom. So kind of took it over and this is what I have in my area that I do my scrapbooking and card making. This stand right here that I have is pretty much um, a fine. I'm, I am a thrift store junkie so I found this table at an antique mall and it was already that color but it was only five bucks. I liked it because it was black and it had shelves and it's a good little fit for some of my little card displays. Um, have my little gel medium and my Prisma color pencils there. Um, that's right next to my little bookcase I got at Walmart. And so when you look at it on the top, you have some of my rub-ons and um, recollection stickers, embellishments. Some of those, I don't have to clip it up, so that's what I have for right now. Um, just a couple ribbons that I had um, thrown inside of there. Um, this little cute baskets, I love baskets. Um, I have some of my uh, Michaels a chipboard albums that I haven't done yet but I picked up and put them right here so I can see them because I plan to work on those. Um, this is the envelopes of the little folders that you get from Michaels that hold all of your uh, projects that you're working on. Um, they're here because I'm going to be using them real soon. Um, my scissor dies are pretty much right here with all of the Tim Holtz, this other Sizzix on the edge die cuts. Um, this stuff in the back is a little purple um, mini file cabinet that I have all my cuddle bug folders in and everything. So that's right there. Um, I try to make use of my space because I'm really getting back into my crafting so I didn't have a lot of things that's um, out and so I've had to when I see videos and I've seen some works I said you know I got to organize my things first so this is the first thing that I worked on is organiz organizing my stuff so some of these shelves actually I found these little boxes here at um, a little thrift store for a dollar a piece. The top drawer is jam packed with all my Tim Holtz. Love all my Tim Holtz um, embellishments and things. So I kind of just stick that in there. Um, here, some bling. A lot of my bling I have in here as well. Um, over here, I have some chipboard letters stick that inside of there um over here of course some more embellishments my binder rings um anything that has enclosures and things like that um over here more stickers it started out with little girl stuff but i do have some holiday winter things that i need to work on but some more embellishments um down here on the second shelf, I have um, more embellishments, bling, uh, recollections, bling. I have in here some of my print flowers. Have to move that. Uh, yeah, some wood letters, pieces. Um, I do a lot of uh, mixing. And uh, with some different mediums, some more Tim Holtz little stickers, uh, some papers that I have to organize. I have a new organizer for my papers, but some more embellishments, stickers, chipboard letters, uh, some more stickers. Um, down here, I have 
couple of like I had to do new, another case for my embellishments. I just got this one, and I have some more down here. This carrying case. This is a set of three, and they actually have a handle that I can carry all three if I need to to cross. So I like that. Um, yeah, some I have some albums stuck over on the side. That's a shadow box. That's right there. Right here is just a small three drawer um, organizer. I do some of the chalk inks at the top. Um, my perfect pearls and some sponges. I do have some more sponges, but I have to put them in there. Um, some of my paints that I use often um, are up here. I do have another area because I have tons of paints. Um, I'll, I'm also a licensed nail technician, so I have another room for my nails and all of that with the nail table. So paint, I have paint galore. Um, have these little three organizers with some glitter, my re-inkers, uh, yeah, my glitter glue, some things that I've worked on, some flowers or cremas that I've used in past projects. This right here, that's right down in there. Some of my mists and sprays, um, embossing powders. This is the album, a little basket for an album that I've been working on. A couple albums, so they're right there, right here next to my desk. Um, this little organizer is pretty new Black Friday Joanne Fabrics. You have to love it. Just the little organizer with all of the 12 by 12 stacks. So I do have to go ahead and label these. My labeler is out of paper, but yeah, I kind of just went ahead and pulled them here and put them in here. They were kind of on the shelf at the bottom over there. So this is a new thing um, for me. This is what I'm most excited about is my table. This table, like I said, I'm into antiques, thrift store finds. This table is actually a table that I found at the antique mall. And here it is. I love this table because it's so big and so wide. It's enough space for everything that I need. And I try to keep it neat. I like it to work neatly, but I know it gets messy real quick. But this table I love because if you see how big it is, it's actually like three different separate panels. And this part extends. It folds up smaller, but I don't. I don't have it like that. I just keep it out and open. What I like was the space because my other table, not a lot of room. This right here was another thrift store find. Um, it is a cassette tape. And I've seen this in another video and I'm all about repurposing and reusing, especially when I can save money. This I love because my ink pads, all the ink pads fit in there. I have started my Tim Holtz collection. I love the Ranger inks, Stays On, Memento, and um, Color Box, all of those. And they're actually, I have enough space to add more. I started out in there, in my white container with my ink pads. Now that I have this, I have a reason to buy more. Over here is my Making Memories um, carousel. So it's enough space on the table that it's here with all of my glue, scissors, rulers, ATG gun, colored pencils. Um, yeah, I love the little compartments that they have inside of here. Um, yeah, so this is my table. And my labeler is here. Things that I need to work on and use right away or do something with stays on my table. Just like this is a project I'm going to start working on for the holidays. So it's here on top of my table. And I have my little mouse pad. I love him. 
this is as close as we're going to get to a little bulldog. He's right here. So, um, I already have two dogs, so I can't really do another one right now. This is another um, container I have with my punches. It's kind of heavy. It's stuffed with punches. I need a better system for this because I can't stand digging through. But here's some stamps, some new stamps that I have to go through and put into my CD cases that I have for all of my uh, stamps. Um, this container is a catch-all, just some uh, random silk flowers, hooks, things like that. Down here are my adhesives, sprays, glue guns, uh, glue dots, things of that nature. Down here I have some more glitters and embellishments. My husband got a bunch of these from work and they're really helpful in all of the little embellishments and the beads that you buy. So I'm going to have to pull them out of here and store them. They, this is too small so they just kept thrown in there for right now. Um, my um, gesso and my embossing powders that I use and everything is right there. I have this binder that has uh, some um, just some copies of um, some digi stamps that I have and I want to work with um, my little tool, of course, my Martha Stewart scoreboard, and I have my trimmer and my Friskers. Um, stamp uh, right there um, underneath the table I love this table you see this has a drawer here so I have some of my markers a little quick toolkit some markers I have um, in here so this is all original I love this because it slides right out um, so under there, just some foam alphabets um, I like to do and have for my nieces that I am creating for. Um, so this is the left side, and I've actually taken over this side. It wasn't supposed to happen, but this is all I could do for right now. Um, this table is where I have my new Cricut, another Black Friday sale had a ball. My cinch, my big shot, my fabric, and I also have my sewing machine. So that is right there. Um, underneath I have just more storage and things like that.